What is that guy's problem? Well, you kind of slept with his daughter on her wedding day. Oh, yeah, that's right. Mike, you just spilled your juice on my shirt. Oh, man, it's all over the flag I got my dad. Who cares? He hates your guts. You know, if you ask me, he doesn't even deserve a birthday present. He's still my dad, Mike. And if I have to be the bigger man, so be it. All right, okay, we'll buy him a new one. I can't, Mike. This is the only one they had. It's the actual flag from his marine company. Hey, just dry it off in the wind. That's the beauty of having a convertible, huh? <laughs> Navy 6, Army 3. Now let's take time out for a news break. <laughs> We're kicking Army ass. A record turnout today for San Francisco's Gay Pride Parade as the gay community presented itself as a political force to be reckoned with. Even the Marines were represented in a parade. Sarge, isn't that your son? <laughs> But I was so close, honey. I was just... I don't care, Dick! But after what he did to our baby, if I let him go now, he wins. It's Bonner or me, and I will not wait a moment longer. Hmm, boy trouble. And how. Hello. Uh, happy birthday, Dad. How dare you call me? Wait, Dad, before you freak out, listen, please. I've got a surprise. No, Gary. No more surprises. But Your I... lifestyle makes me sick. I'm proud of my lifestyle, Dad. Mike and I are doing what we want to do. Mike. I'm guessing now he's your life partner. Yeah, I guess so. Because he's got my back and I've got his. I pray to God you have the sense to use prophylactics. Mike does, but there's really no need for me to use him. I order you to come home this instant. What for? Your dad signed you up for the freaking Marines? That's it. I'm never talking to that son of a bitch again. You know what you need, Gary? An evening with Candy Mouth at the Nipple Barn? I hate the Nipple Barn. No, you hate the Nipple Hot. The barn is first class. Okay, I'm in. Excellent! There ain't nothing but open road from here on out. Mike, what are you doing? You have no idea how to fix the car. I'm not fixing the car. I'm fixing a grilled cheese sandwich. You two look like you could use a hand. Oh, got it, baby! Thanks, Bruno. My mechanic will have your car fixed within the hour. Well, thank you so much. Oh, it's nothing. Cocktail? Uh, no thanks. We don't really drink before noon. Hey, come on, Gary. It's noon somewhere. <laughs> okay, maybe one. <laughs> then that bastard tells me that he's putting me in the Marine Corps as soon as I get home. Fascinating. Can I ask you a question, Gary? Have you ever wondered what it would be like if, say, your father was, uh, well, no longer around? Oh, sure, all the time. Sometimes I get so mad I can just kill him. <laughs> oh, Gary, I knew we were cut from the same cloth. You know, sometimes I could just kill my wife. <laughs> say, let's play a game, shall we? It's called crisscross. Okay, but I gotta warn you, I'm pretty good at games. Let's say you were to commit murder. How could you do it without getting caught? Oh, gosh. Mm, I don't know. I do. See, we both have problems in our lives, right? If I were to take care of your problem, i.e. your father, and you were to take care of my problem... I.e. your wife... Yes! You do my murder, I'll do yours. Crisscross. A stranger kills a stranger. There's nothing connecting the murderer to the victim, hence unsolvable. <laughs> the perfect crime. Now, <laughs> how do you commit the murder? Uh, gun. Too loud. Uh, strangulation. Hmm. That's a little sweaty, isn't it, Gary? 
Personally, I'd go with a nice, relaxing, narcotic cocktail. Half strychnine, half potassium cyanide, with just a dash of belladonna. It's quiet, relatively painless, nothing to endure but the prick of a needle. Hey, why not just push the person down the stairs? You know, make it look like an accident. <laughs> That's more like it. <laughs> now you're thinking like a real killer. Thanks again for fixing our car. And for the aspirin. So, you like my idea, Gary? Uh, yeah. Great. Wonderful. I've got to go to New York for a few days. Feel free to drop by the house anytime. Oh, you're not really gonna call that freak, are you? Why not? He's the nicest guy we've met since we've been on the road. Yeah, nice and a totally creepy show me on this doll where he touched you kind of way. Oh, another two weeks. Well, Jared, as long as the bills are paid, I don't care if you ever come home. Henry! Damn it! Henry! <laughs> You know, this was supposed to be my midnight snack, not my 1202 snack! I'm sorry, Mrs. Wessler, but the kitchen Yes, 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 yes. I'm sure you've got a million brilliant excuses. Mm. Now get out of my bedroom before I scream rape! Yes, Mrs. Wessler. Huh. Let's see what he botched up this. Oh, perfect. No butter for the scone. You son of a... Henry! Damn it! Hi, sweetie. Are you back for good? You'll never hear me mention the name Mike Bonner again. Oh, welcome home, Mittens. Mm -hmm. As the former football great continues to look for the real killer. In other news, socialite Vanessa Wessler, wife of tire magnate Jared Wessler, was found dead last night from injuries suffered in a fall at their home. Oh my God, that's Jared's wife. We have to go to the funeral. What about the strip club tonight? Jared was there for us, Mike. The least we can do is be there for him. Come on, would you rather be looking at a stiff or sport one? Funerals are so sad. Yeah, so sad. Tragic. Boo-hoo. Okay, if we hustle, we can still make two-for-one lap dances at the nipple barn. What? Come on, it's what she would have wanted. Hmm. <clears throat> <laughs> Gary, what are you doing here? Do you think this is wise? Oh, you did me a solid. It's the least I could do. Oh, but it's you who's done me the solid. I did? An accidental tumble down the stairs. <gasps> Brilliant. And now it's my turn. Crisscross. What? Please, Gary, we can't be seen together. It'll ruin everything. Now, if you'll excuse me... <laughs> I've got an appointment in St. Louis. It's you who's done me the solid. An accidental tumble down the stairs. Now it's my turn. Crisscross. I've got an appointment in St. Louis. Crisscross. Crisscross. Criss oh my God. Jared's going to murder my father. Okay, what's the worst thing that can happen? My dad gets brutally murdered? No, no, Gary. The worst thing. Very funny. Uh, Jared? Hi, it's Gary. Yeah, I'm so glad I caught you. I think there's been a huge misunderstanding here. Probably my fault. Um, I really don't want you to kill my father. Of course you don't. I wouldn't think of it. Oh, great. I'm so glad we had a chance to clear this up. <laughs> Me too. And just so we're crystal clear, Gary, there's no chance I'm on my way to 344 Oak Street with a syringe full of strychnine potassium cyanide and a dash of belladonna. <laughs> That's a relief. Thanks, Jared. Bye-bye. Wait a minute! That's my parents' address! Hello? 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 <laughs>
Just a few more tests, Dick. Boys uptown need to be sure you're over this Mike Bonner thing. Fire away, Bill. Oh, what do you see? A unicorn. Very good. All right. And this. Mike Bone R. Microphone boner. Excellent. Well, Dick, looks like the only thing left for me to do is sign this file cured. Whoops, I dropped my pencil. Where's your daughter at, man? <laughs> Good one, Bill. <laughs> Congratulations, Dick. You're back on the force. Now get out there and do some racial profiling. Dad! Dad! Gary! You're okay. Oh, thank God. Dad, someone's trying to kill you. Oh, really? Well, uh, that certainly is good to know. Hey, Mr. Ann. Hey, happy birthday from us. Uh, what's this? Oh, uh, Mike spilled his juice. Yeah, sorry. It just uh, kind of shot out all over. <laughs> I was covered with the stuff. Mike, I know Gary is very special to you. W would you mind giving us some, uh... Alone time. Uh, yeah, sure. Later. Dad, I can't tell you how glad I am that you're still alive. Thank you, son, but unfortunately, I died two days ago when I saw my half-naked son leading a homosexual parade while waving a Marine Corps flag from my very own unit. What? A record turnout today for San Francisco's Gay what? Pride Parade. Oh, no, Dad, you got it wrong. We didn't... <laughs> Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. It's no secret that some of you have God-forbidden thoughts. But just because you sleep, eat, shave, shower, and march with men does not mean that you should make sweet, passionate love to them. A homosexual can be found anywhere and sports many fancy monikers. A gay, a Nancy, a swell, a swift, a Streisand, a chest shaver, a white wine enjoyer, a totem polar, anyone British, a cockadoodle dandy. It can start with the most innocent of come-ons. The next thing you know, you're shaft deep in enemy territory. But don't take my word for it, Private Pansy. Hey there, Sergeant Dreamboat. Why, I oughta... Say, what have you been up to? Oh, just visiting the privates in boot camp. Uh-oh, let's see how they're doing. Those army pants really flatter your behind. And these old things? I just threw them on because my other army pants were dirty. They couldn't be any dirtier than the ones you're wearing. But Dad, I'm not gay! Good start, son. Denial is the first step on the road to recovery. Now get some shut-eye. <laughs> God, it's just a plumber. Jerry! I'm here to inspect your water heater. Uh, Chief? That's ah, right down here. Now, this isn't going to cost me anything, is it? Just your life. What the? Oh, crisscross. <laughs> Hey, Jared. Jared? Try more Vaseline, Mike. Well, it would help if you'd relax. Uh, 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 ow! Come on. Ow! Uh, oh, 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 sorry to interrupt, but we've got to help your father. He's acting funny. Is this what you meant by him acting funny? He, he's still got a pulse. Let's get him to the hospital. I can't believe we're renewing our wedding vows. Well, it's a new beginning for us, sweetheart. Honey, what's wrong? Bonner. Dick, be strong. Dick, Dick. It's either Bonner or me, Dick. I've never seen a man survive such a massive dose of strychnine. It it's as if someone has been slowly poisoning him for years and his body has built up a tolerance to it. Well, I wonder who would do such a thing. Oh, dee -dee, da -dum, da -dum. Can you believe it, Mike? We saved his life. 
If this doesn't get you out of the Marine Corps, nothing will. Would the three of you mind stepping out for a moment? Well, sure, Doc, no problem. Thank you, Gary. Hey, how did he know my name? No! I like you, Gary. I'm only trying to pay you back. Crisscross. Gary! Hey, we need some help! Oh, it wasn't me who killed your wife! And I don't want you to kill my father! What was in there? Bad things? No, Jared, don't die! Christ. Oh, Dad, I'm not gay! We'll let the Corps make that decision. I just saved your life. Doesn't that mean anything to you? How did you making gay love to that doctor save my life? He's not a doctor. He's a psychopathic killer. Where did they teach you to lie like that? Gay camp. We got a doctor down. What happened here? Tell him, Jared. <sighs> this man here, Gary Newton, is a murderer. What? He murdered my beautiful wife, Vanessa Wessler, and he just now injected me with a lethal dose of strychnine. No, that's a lie! Don't worry, son. We'll get the best lawyers in the land to defend you. And he's gay. Oh. Shoot him! Shoot him dead! Gary! Hey. What? We gotta get out of here, man. Hey, come back here! Oh, you got to go out there! Uh, Maybe we should go back inside. Gary Newton, you are wanted for the murder of Jared and Vanessa Wessler. Or out here's good. Hey, there's the Bel Air. And there's a jumping castle. No way, Mike. Those kids are really sick. Bye-bye, fornicator. Ah! What about the kids? They're gonna die anyway! Stop shooting! There are kids down there! No, it's all right. They're gonna die anyway. Sorry, sorry. Hope you feel better. Damn it! We did it. We lost him. <laughs> Back on the road again. Feels good, doesn't it? Just you and me and a whole world of possibility. Watching Comedy Central. If you thought freshman year was rough, wait till you see it animated. Stick around for undergrads. Coming up next.